you know, I cut my hair. Why'd you do that? Because I don't want to be pretty no more. Because it don't do nothing will cause you trouble. Think of what got me into this mess. Yeah? What got you? Being attractive. And what do you attract? Crazy people. So, what do you see as similarities between all the different men who have been in your life, besides the fact that they're men? How are they similar? How are they different? Selfish. That's what they're saying. They're all selfish. They do whatever to get what they want. It makes them happy. They don't think about others' happiness. And everything that they do, they feel they're justified. They don't ever accept fault. That's what my dad said. He said uh, in his letter, he goes home and sleeps at night knowing that he did his best. What did Johnny want from you? Sex. For money. No. They all wanted acceptance and admiration. Hell yeah. That's what they wanted. My dad wanted to be admired because of the hard work he put in driving trucks and making that money and supplying us with the life that we lived. Mm, cutthroat. He wanted to be admired by everyone else in the street because I remember that one time he said that we, I was going to work and get him this truck. It was a Suburban on some 26s. He wanted admiration. He wanted somebody to respect him. He wanted people to admire him. That's, oh my God. And then you got Johnny. What did he say? I want a woman to make love with me with desire. Remember I told you that part? Desire. He wants to be accepted. Oh yeah, and those are my f problems. How are they your f problems? Because I always want to be accepted. For 18 f years. That's part of the reason I cut my hair off and shave my eyebrows off. It's kind of like to prove to myself that I'm beautiful without all that, you know what I mean? And I'm worth more than that. And did you feel that? Yeah. Every now and then I feel stupid for cutting all my hair off and shaving my eyebrows, but basically, yeah. I think I've been, for the past two years, working on making a personality. I've never had one before.